Hey everybody, it's Sabrina from Atlas, and today I have something very special to share with you. If you are a violinist who is struggling with making a silky sound and smooth bow changes and flexible, flexible wrist, I have one trick that I'm sure is going to make a difference in your life. Okay, so our bow arm works best when there's kind of this square from your elbow to your knuckles and up to your shoulder and, and where the bow meets the string. This is when, of course, the bow is in the middle. But one thing that we often don't think about is what happens from the wrist and knuckles down. Here's the trick. If you just let those fingers hang down from your wrist and from your knuckles so that they can, you know, so that they they can dangle. You're going to have so much more flexibility. Now imagine if you're holding your knuckles up. Just try it. You're going to notice everything locks up and you have no movement and that doesn't make for a smooth sound or any flexibility whatsoever. So if you can remember to just let your hand dangle like this, voila. Now, it, it also will naturally make the bow tilt away from you. If you want more sound, you do have to flatten the hair a little bit, but you can do that with the thumb and not with your wrist. So you can wiggle that bow in your hand just with the thumb. Uh, you can try that too. That will change how much hair you use, but generally, we have the bow just on a little bit of a tilt away from us so that the fingers hang. Go ahead and try it. Thanks for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed this short and sweet tutorial with just one little tip that has been so helpful for me, especially when I get stage fright performing. This little gesture of just relaxing um, and it's something so physical that you can do even if you're nervous, you can really just get your body to drop, drop the fingers, and can change everything. So I hope you find it helpful. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're interested in more content like it, subscribe to our channel.